Hello, and welcome, welcome, welcome. I've actually done some re-rolling to find an interesting start, and I think we found something here with Point Luna. Uh, a lot of people like Point Luna, that's just how it is. Maybe we start with a little bit extra card draw here for some space tags, and 10 extra titanium. Not that we really need it. The thing that I love about this Point Luna start is the Mars U and Optimal Arrow Breaking. That's really powerful to begin with. And then Earth Office and Standard Project. Now, Standard Project is a great thing to back up on, uh, but it's not necessarily the best thing, right? Uh, what we're really going to want to do, though, is get a bunch of free cards with our Earth Tags, and then we're going to be able to cycle those cards with our Science Tags. Now, do we want to start with as much Titanium as we're starting with? I doubt it. I actually think that instead of... Well, no, I want the card draw and I want the production. So I wanted the steel here, but... It's fine. And I do want to grab kind of a little bit heavy on cards here with the Lava Flows and the Media Archives. Because you never know what you're going to hit. Um, so let's get this Titanium and more Titanium. And we actually got Space Events. Deimos down and Standard Technology. Love it. We get another card draw here. Ants, less powerful. But we did get Lunar Beam. So the question is, do we go straight into optimal arrow breaking or not? It's really the question here, because we could get Mars U right now as well and just do some card cycling. I think we play it a little bit slow and go Lunar Beam here. Get a little bit of heat coming in and just pass. Let's see if we get some sort of discount or something. Asteroid mining, for instance. All of this is cool, but instead, let's just get the asteroid mining get that income up that's 10 of our titanium and let's not worry about tempo for a minute we'll grab a card cycling engine get that started and let's get rid of ants water import from Europa okay I don't think we went we have a Jovian okay maybe maybe space events we love them uh honestly we love all of this it's just all good uh are we gonna do anything with our money and time here debatable this is a card cycle what do we want to cycle though is the question i think it's zeppelins And we'll get the energy production as well. So four energy coming in is kind of nice. Next turn, we might start playing some of these space events, but also maybe not. Do we have any way of getting steel? Yes, with Deimos down, and yes, with placements. We'll see. So how far are we from anti-grav? Many, many science tags away. Let's start with our Earth here. That got us some income. And let's play this bad boy for the sake of a technology demonstration. We're not going to overpay. Large convoy fuel generators. We're on Tharsis. We're on the basic map. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, what a disaster. I don't know what we care for at least between um i think the energy tapping because i i kind of don't mind these though they're probably next on the hit list especially if we have nuclear power let's not go too long before we start playing cards that give us income eh oxygen honestly this is i hate ox gang but this serves us many purposes so i'm gonna play and listen to this we're gonna play ironworks and that's gonna get us a steel then we're gonna talk about space elevator where i'm missing three dollars missing three dollars i really don't want to sell anything if we had a really cheap space event we would be able to do what i want to do here but we just can't 
I'd have to sell three cards and one, two, three. I mean, I hate it, but it's pretty doable. We'll just have to get more cards. We'll just have to get more cards. It's fine because this, this is tempo. We buy this, we have five titanium production. We're now getting an oxygen bump every turn and $5 because the steel that we make with it we turn into five bucks. So like that's that's powerful for us. We have a Jovian. And we'll, we'll grab all this. Yeah, 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 okay. So we make oxygen, we sell the steel, then Bam, baby. Three heat production, three energy production. Love it. We do need to keep our eye open for some science tags to get our anti-grav going. We're not seeing it just yet, but we would like to. I don't want to grab any more cities, do I? Yeah, I guess I do. It's fine. So, boom, oxygen, boom, cell. The fact that we're using ox gang means that we can go a little bit more aggressive in other ways. We do have a science tag here at the end, but that's not even close to being enough. So Arctic Algae and Terraforming Ganymede are both really, really good cards. Arctic Algae in particular is going to make or break this game. Yeah. Yeah, let's just double check. Yeah, money back on, on space events. So Arctic Algae is fantastic. And then let's go for a ton of card draw up here. Uh, sorry, what did I get? Mining area. Mm. I guess we could put that city down sooner rather than later. Fuel factory and a one point animal. Oxygen and then some steel. Um, okay. I think Immigrant City goes here. I don't see any other way of getting our mining area other than lava flows. But even then, I'd probably want a city. Well, I want a city here and a city here. But this city specifically can't... Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we can do it. It's fine. So we go Immigrant City here. Because I don't want steel for some reason. I don't know why. Take it out with corporate. Because I'm not sure. Yeah, see that's just bad. That's a bad city now. I don't know why I did this. Uh, this is a good time for the Comet though. That's a heat bump. Another oxygen. And we're still only at two science tags, which is a little bit killer. But we have a lot of TR all of a sudden, so that's moving. There's a science tag, there's a Jovian. Are we playing an ocean? Not really. Not really. So oxygen, steel, heat. Um, hmm. What are we thinking, gang? What are we thinking? Could be a good time for the demos. Just really rock the world. Or it could be a good time for a points per Jovian. Let's take a second to get a card cycle. literally like unplayable and get you know what we're just gonna water import because i think we need to start hauling oceans in
and then one more titanium income because we're spending four of it on an ocean every turn so it's like we have five okay this is it's doable it's doable there's a heat bump we like we like heat bumps archaea bacteria is unplayable as of one turn ago this is a really cheap points card but say la vie uh oxygen gets the heat this does that ocean says me we're still going down this trench for now i'm gonna buy this city just for the sake of getting this card wasn't that good do i regret it well i didn't know what it was gonna be so i wouldn't say regret but was not super hot that's for sure let's get another energy production we just lost one so keep a little bit of a profile if we do this we won't be able to afford our oxygen every round we're up to how many um events played five i don't think we're gonna get anti-grav my dudes i don't think so shuttles is nice though yes yes uh, i guess we could play invention contest right away local heat trapping for the fish Hmm. How do we feel, gang? Once we have the fish down, I just want it to be clear that we're going to get an extra fish here, an extra two fish here, and then an extra two fish here, and then an extra four fish here. So we're going to we're going to win this in in fish not in jovians though the jovians are gonna also bring us a long way so really that's our winning our win condition there's something i don't know how we get to it uh, let's talk about heat we have basically two heat bumps in production but not if i use local heat trapping so we only have one heat bump so i think we need to lava flow and there's only one spot left for it so let's start with the physics complex just to get the science tag and see if something comes up i mean as much as i like the, the penal colonies i'm worried that that's a pathway for disaster let's get a card draw here just for a second I have to sell a card because I think it's worth getting fish this turn that's a really cheap point cheap point cheap point cheap point I don't think the science is gonna hit for us but I'm unwilling to give up on those three points basically we got to look at it like this like we're gonna get an oxygen bump next turn we're gonna get a greenery and then maybe with some ocean placements another greenery so we still need a greenery how many oceans do we have one really expensive one like yikes so we still need an ocean and then the three heat bumps like especially if i'm doing this we only have one heat bump we're gonna get some heat back on our space events so probably two uh but that means that i can't play this because I'm at 14. Instead of selling a card, let's just play an early. 
in early media archives. I don't love it, but extreme cold fungus, lame. So there's a fish. Uh, doing a physics complex as well would have been amazing because that would have been a two point use of uh, CEO's favorite project, but couldn't make it happen. We need that energy. I think that this city is somehow worth it, but it isn't worth it at all. We have 11 titanium. Oh, no. No, no. I was thinking if we put the city here, then we go here, and that's a $6 payback, and then we're getting points for that city. And then we also get payback on the next ocean we put down. I think we do want this research outpost. It's a little bit insane. It's a little bit insane. It's a lot insane. But like... But what if? What if it wasn't insane? Right? Like what if it wasn't crazy? So there's a heat bump. And then the mass converter is a bit crazy, <laughs> but what if, what if it worked? Okay, what if it worked? What if I'm throwing? That's a good point. That is a really good point. Um, all right, so now we have to haul in plants instead of animals with large convoy, I think. Well, I don't know. We get five plants here or we get four plants here. So let's not jump the gun on that. We put this bad boy down. Put this bad boy down. Four plants here. Money back because of space. Yeah, let's... um. I really want to take this as animals, but I just can't do it. Well, the ocean itself gives me two plants. So if I, and then the, the green replacement gives me, you know what? Let's be greedy and see what happens. Oh, I don't know, man. This is like all our money. Screw it. Four fish. Let's go. Then greenery down. The worst part is how much, how many points we could be getting from our Jovians that we're not going to be. Like that's the worst part. Well, and not getting anti-grav hurts too, but. All right, so I think I have to do, I have to get two plants. I could do that a couple of different ways. I could use this to make plants, but then I give up a heat bump. I could do a corporate stronghold here for net one points. Or here and lose a point because I'll put a greenery here and make a little bit more money I just wish I had one more heat because I don't right now and that hurts so yeah I mean that makes money so that's the oxygen taken care of we need two heat bumps we can buy them And we're gonna buy it. I mean, we just gotta buy it. It's there's so much potential in in this hand to go like the distance, like the terraforming Ganymede, the Callisto Penal Mines, the 
open city is probably what I should have played just now instead of a corporate stronghold. I just didn't think I would have enough. Then the Vesta, like, oh, it's so nasty. So then Asteroid allows me to play the local heat trapping for the two animals because we are one heat short. And then this is a adjacency to our city that gives us a steel. And we would rather sell uh, Lightning Harvest to afford Vesta because we've played A points per Jovian with water import from Europa. I mean, we still managed to get 26 points on cards and a decent number of, like, lackluster cities. But, uh, you know, you know, it still didn't break 100. If we had, if we had hit the Jovian multipliers, if we had hit the discount sooner, if we had gotten the money rebate or like, there's a lot of things that we could have hit. And that's always true for every game. Either way, I had a good time. This was lined up to go the distance and then we just didn't hit any earth tags uh, as point Luna. It happens. We also didn't hit any science tags as anti-grav runners. So I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Ciao for now.